Hello everyone and welcome back to Bitcoin Tips. So today we're going to be talking about how you can start mining Digibyte coin using your Windows 10 or 11 base computer here in 2024 in less than 10 minutes. So if all of that sounds interesting to you, I do want to make sure to ask you to stick around through the entire video so that you don't miss out on any of the great tips and tricks that I have to help save you coins and grow your holdings even faster when mining Digibyte. So, before we dive into the video today, I always do like to start off here on CoinMarketCap, just taking a look at what's going on in the markets as a point of reference if you do happen to be watching this video in the future. So if you aren't interested in this portion of the video, feel free to skip ahead one to two minutes and we'll be getting into the, the tutorial then. But overall, as you can see, we actually have a pretty strong down day here in crypto, about 2% over the whole market cap to about 2.8%. 1.9 trillion. Now, with that being said, looking on the 24-hour chart, even in the top 10, there is a little bit of green, which is nice to see. But looking on the week chart, we are seeing a lot of red. Now, it's only been about a week and a half since Bitcoin halved here in 2024, and I don't think this is anything to be too concerning. Usually, historically, looking at the charts, prices have fallen a little bit after the halving. You know, everybody is so excited for it; it happens, and there really isn't any major event you know it just does its thing and the blockchain keeps going but with that being said i think we still have six to eight months before we're going to start seeing any really good price movements now of course we are talking about digibyte today so i want to take a second to look at this coin which is currently priced at just over one cent per coin now if you're not familiar with this coin it's a really strong coin that's been around for a number of years back in 2021 when the uh, last bull run happened this coin was about 14 15 cents a coin so there is a 15x possibility here on this coin if it was to just get back to its all-time high from 2021. Now, of course, no one knows if that's going to happen, but if you believe in this coin and the project, with it being priced at one cent right now, there's a lot of room for it to head back up and make a lot of profit. So how do you start mining this coin? Now, Digibyte is traditionally a coin that you can mine. It's actually a multi-algorithm coin, but I am recommending using Unminable here because of the ease of use and just it, it works really well. You can switch it up very easily and I think it's a great site. So basically what Unminable does, if you're not familiar, is it allows you to mine the most profitable algorithm for your computer. So maybe you're making, you know, let's just keep it easy and say a dollar per day mining Digibyte regularly straight up with it. Here, maybe your computer does better on the Kapow algorithm and it makes you $2 a day. You're actually able to earn more Digibyte because you're mining a more profitable algorithm. They're taking care of the conversion on the back end and paying you out. Now, if you aren't familiar with what's best for your hardware, I would recommend checking out whattomine.com. It's a great site that allows you to enter in your hardware and basically tells you what's best for you. Now I will say if you are mining with a 20, 30, or 40 series GPU and are watching this video relatively soon after it was uploaded, you're most likely going to be mining with Kapow, but I do always recommend checking out what to mine just in case anything has changed since crypto is always changing and something more profitable may have come out. So what you're going to do is select get started with our wizard. There are two modes, basic and advanced. I always recommend going with basic. It's good for 99% of people, but there is also an advanced if you want to get into some of the more intricate settings. Again, I'm going to be going with the GPU option here, but you can also follow this tutorial with a Mac or a Windows-based CPU by choosing the CPU option. And again, here's where you would choose the best algorithm for your hardware. Now, of course, I'm going with Kapow, but please choose what's best for your computer. And here's where you get to choose the coin that you're going to get paid out in. Now, of course, we're talking about Digibyte today, but I do like to take a second to say, if you get to this screen and you see another coin that's maybe a little bit more interesting to you, you think maybe mining a meme coin is better, or maybe you're just interested in something else, feel free to choose that coin. All it's going to do is mean you have to enter in an address that goes along with that coin, but you can still follow this tutorial and use the discount code, which we'll talk about in just a minute, to mine here on Unminable. But once I choose Digibyte, you can see you can enter in your address, which I do like to say, please double and triple check this address is correct. This is how you will get paid out. The miner will still run if this address is incorrect. It will not notify you and say, hey, you know, you're not going to be able to get paid. It just thinks as long as it's a valid address, you will get paid. So you see if I delete that Z, 
it has no idea that this is the wrong address. If I put too many characters, it does eventually say, hey, it seems to be invalid, but with just an extra Z there, it still thinks this is correct. So please double and triple check that. But what you can do is go ahead and say next, and you're at the final step before downloading the miner and getting started. And this is where I like to call out that I do have a referral code, just Bitcoin-Tips with a capital B and a capital T. It's down in the description below, as well as the link to Unminable. But what this is actually going to do for you is save you 25% on your Unminable pool fee. So here on Unminable, when you are mining, you have a 1% fee. Flat out, it you know, doesn't matter what coin you're mining. It doesn't matter if Digibyte's one cent or one dollar. As long as you are mining, if you mine every 100 coins, you're paying one to Unminable. By using this Bitcoin Tips referral code, you're reducing that to 0.75%, meaning you get to keep an additional 25% of the coins that you would have otherwise given to Unminable. So I always recommend using this, but please feel free to continue if you don't want to use that. And the final step is downloading the miner and getting started. Now, I usually recommend G-Miner as it works with both major GPU manufacturers as well as it's worked really well for me. But please feel free to choose what you are most interested in. I do like to call out that certain miners here like Team Red and T-Rex Miner only support one or the other major GPU manufacturer. So please make sure you choose the one that supports your hardware. But what you're going to do is select download miner files and then choose the windows 64 zip file here this will download a zipped folder make sure you extract that file if you do not extract it this will not work once you extract those files come back to unminable and select download.bat file and drag and drop this downloaded file into the same folder that you extracted everything else into now i will say that when you go to download these files you will most likely get a call out in your browser saying hey you are downloading an unverified file are you sure you want to do this you are going to have to say yes if you want to continue with mining now with that being said if you are not comfortable doing that simply don't do it. Unfortunately, there is no workaround. It is just a part of mining, but don't download anything if you are not comfortable doing that. But if you are comfortable and proceeded to download, what you're going to do is just pull up this file here. This is where I extracted all my folders, or I'm sorry, all the files. And as you can see, I dragged and dropped this unminable DGB Kapow gminer.bat file. All you have to do is double click this to get started. Now you can see I did get a Windows protected your PC error. You will have to say more info and run anyway. Again, if you are not comfortable doing this, please select don't run. Unfortunately, there is no other workaround apart from disabling your antivirus altogether, which is just not a good idea in general. But assuming you're comfortable with that, you can say run anyway. And as you can see, in less than 10 minutes, about eight minutes to be exact here including an intro with coin market cap we are up and running mining digibyte using an rtx 2080 on the kapow algorithm so with that being said a few extra callouts i like to mention here about mining with unminable even though everything is up and running right now it's all green no red no errors we are good to go. It's still going to take 15 to 30 minutes for stats to start appearing on the website. That's completely normal. If you don't see anything after about an hour, hour and a half, you may have something configured incorrectly. I would recommend going back through the setup. And if that doesn't work, please feel free to leave a comment down below. Always happy to help troubleshoot and get you up and running. And on the other side, when you are ready to be done mining, maybe you want a game or use your computer for something else or just shut it down. All you have to do to stop mining is find this window and hit the X. Once that is completely closed out, you are no longer mining. Now, the reason I like to call this out, because let's be honest, closing a window is pretty simple. On Unminable, when you stop the miner, you're going to continue to see stats, payments, things like that reporting on the site for one hour or more. I can personally say I've seen payments come in on an account where I was no longer mining 12 hours after stopping the miner. So it's a little strange and it's led some people to believe that they were still mining. But just know as long as that CMD window is completely closed out, you will eventually stop mining and getting paid on the website, but your computer can be used for other things. So with that being said, again, the links are down below in the description. I do highly recommend that you check them out if you're interested in mining. And again, I do have that Bitcoin tips referral code to save you 25% on your pool mining fee. 
So thank you so much for watching. And if you haven't already, please consider subscribing to Bitcoin Tips so you don't miss out on any of the great tips and tricks I have here in crypto. And make sure to like and share this video with your friends and family so that everybody can take advantage of these lower prices, start building their holdings, and be more prepared for the next bull run. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye.